Creme de la Creme, A24, great partners, and Viet, you know, this was seemingly an unadaptable story. It kind of takes place in the mindset. But to answer your question, I think the American perspective on Vietnam is clearly shaped by our ideals and the way we were kind of indoctrinated to think about our country during the Cold War. And I think with so many things going on nowadays, this idea of fully immersing yourself in the perspective of uh, the other is uh, a really good exercise. So. Yeah, and at its heart, it's really a human story. You know, the politics aside, it, you connect with these characters and the duality that they're all kind of struggling with. And I think that's an important thing for us all to look at. We're kind of seeing the humanity through that. A hundred percent. Yes. Thank you both. No challenge with HBO, they are the creme de la creme, A24, great partners, and Viet, you know, this was seemingly an unadaptable story. It kind of takes place in the mindset. And But to answer your question, I think the American perspective on Vietnam is clearly shaped by our ideals and the way we were kind of indoctrinated to think about our country during the Cold War. And I think with so many things going on nowadays, this idea of fully immersing yourself in the perspective of uh, the other is uh, a really good exercise. So, Yeah, and at its heart, it's really a human story. You know, the politics aside, it, you connect with these characters and the duality that they're all kind of struggling with. And I think that's an important thing for us all to look at. Robert, right here, Mr. Damage. It's so it's so exciting. Just look at the cast. Look at who has been on this on this carpet. I mean, I, in in my career, you know, it's trying to get onto this carpet and then being the only one on this carpet. Then maybe a few of us, but to have the entire carpet, I think that is just thrilling to be a part of and thrilling to see. It's great. <laughs> Uh, 그 우리의 의도가 잘 전달되지 않을까 생각해서 그렇게 캐스팅을 했습니다. Because of my experience, I had lived through the same thing. Uh, it was it, it was haunting and surreal, and it was a night shoot, so it was like two o'clock in the morning. We were running around on a, on a runway trying to get on a plane, so it was almost like it, it was take, it took me back to where I was uh, doing my experience of being evacuated uh, just a couple of days before. The country fell. And having lived through that experience, is there any hesitancy jumping into the story knowing you'd have to relive some of these moments? No, I, I reveled in it. I, I wanted it. Um, I wanted it to sort of touch me and it kind of open me up so that I could, you know, release some of these uh, feelings and emotions that have been carrying around with me for years. So I, I welcomed it. Ms. Ola, right here, please. Right there. I'm so proud. I'm so proud to be part of the series. Um, I feel so lucky, uh, so blessed uh, that Hollywood, uh, that HBO, uh, A24, has uh, taken on this project and to keep it in its true voice and not take the book and make it into some Hollywood uh, thing that they stay very true to the book. 
um, we felt seen, we felt heard, we felt uh, respected. Yeah.